everybody, Aaron Blaze here. And I don't know if you saw, but a couple of weeks ago, we did a live stream where I went through some of my old boxes. I've just moved into a new house and some of these boxes I've had have been packed up for 10 years. And I pulled out some maquettes, which you can see here. For those of you that don't know what maquettes are, back when I worked for Disney, what we would do is when we would design a character for a movie, say Simba from The Lion King, we would design the character and then they would make these maquettes, these statues that the artist could use as reference to get, look at different angles, different things like that to draw the characters. Almost every character in a film gets a maquette and we use them exclusively for the movie, movies themselves. They're very, very cool. Uh, they're very valuable. They have a lot of sentimental value to me. And I thought it might be fun to go ahead and open up some of the other boxes. Like I said, these have been boxed up for over 10 years. Some of these boxes, I don't know what they have in them. They're marked with maquettes, but some of them might be bronze statues or, or whatever. I don't know, but um, why don't we just go ahead and, and start opening them up? All right, so here is our first box, and it is heavy. It is full, so I'm not sure what's in here, uh, but we're going to find out. I'm so excited. Like I said, it's been 10 years since I've opened up a lot of these boxes. And, and uh, to me, it's just like Christmas because they, these things, they bring back so much, so many memories. And, and, uh, and I just love the art. A lot of these were sculpted by my friend Tony Cipriano, who, if you guys have been on Creature Art Teacher, my website, you'll know that Tony Cipriano is one of our sculpting teachers. He teaches ZBrush, how to sculpt in ZBrush. All right, what do we got here? Oh, okay. So this, here we got, we do have a maquette. It doesn't look like it got bubble wrapped, which is kind of annoying. But it's very well packed. I'll, I'll see that. Oh, you're going to like this one. Oh, this is a good one. It's the Mother Grizzly from Brother Bear. She got some paper on her nose. Look at that, boy. This is the mama bear that goes off the, goes off the glacier. This is the bear that Kenai goes off to hunt. There she is. Boy, I gotta clean up her face a little bit. 10 years she was sitting in this box. Look at that. Beautiful. Once again, this is sculpted by Tony Cipriano. There's Coda's mom right there. There's Coda and Coda's mom. We got another box in here. A box inside a box. All right. Oh, I know who this is. Well, I know it's one of two characters. Let's see if we can keep this from breaking i'd hate to go have this stuff all perfectly packed for 10 years and then i break it when i unpack it here we go this is rut look at that <laughs> when we find toque their two their two bases fit together because they're the brothers in the movie the moose brothers voiced by rick moranis this character yeah i love it Put him right here. Okay, we got box number two of five boxes that we're going to be going through today. Box number two. Let's see what we have in here. So far, we got Mama Bear and we got Rut from Brother Bear, which is super cool. Let's see what we got. Oh, there we go. Let's see what's in here. Oh, it's Denahi from from Brother Bear. 
Let's see if we can open this up. There we go. There he is. There's Danahi. Hunting his brother. This one's sculpted by Tony Cipriano. Really nicely done. Danahi was animated by Ruben Aquino. One of our great animators at Disney. Put him right there. We got another one in here. All right, let's see what we got here. Oh. Oh, this is an awesome one. This is a great one. Wow. These are great. Here we go. It's our buddy Kenai and Coda. There's Kenai. This is how we see him pretty much throughout the movie, Kenai and Coda. There's Coda sleeping on his, right on his back. Pretty amazing, huh? Mm -hmm. that, that Tony Cipriano, he was a heck of a sculptor. Sculptor, he is so good. Just put him right here. Put him right about there. Yeah. All right, let's go ahead and get rid of this box. Okay, here is box number three. Look at what we got so far. Man, I've got a, I got a lot of maquettes. <laughs> well, it's 21 years working at Disney, animating and directing. You're going to come out with a lot of stuff. There. A box. A little box. All right, let's see what we got here. Well, it's definitely another me. Ooh, I know this one. <laughs> yes, look at this. Look at this, look at this. It's going to take a little bit of cutting here. But we've got Raja from Aladdin. I designed Raja and animated him in the movie. And so I ended up with a maquette of him. There we go. See if I can back him out. He's really dusty. See this one I had painted at Disney from the, in the ink and paint department. I think it was Irma Cartier painted it for me. But there, there he is. All right, we'll put him over here. All right. We got another one here. Let's see what we got. Oh, <laughs> that's funny. This one was actually a gift from one of the other productions that we got at Disney. And it's labeled, the, 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 the people that packed all this, they, their, their sense of, uh, their knowledge of animals aren't quite right. Because this is marked as a giraffe. And I was like, giraffe? I know I don't have any sculptures of giraffe. There we go. Look, it's Cusco. Losing the little label on the bottom. But there's Cusco from Emperor's New Groove. All right, box number four is coming up. So far, we've got a pretty good collection going. We got Cusco, we got Raja, and almost all the characters from Brother Bear. You know, I directed Brother Bear, or co directed it. Bob Walker and I directed it. And, uh, and so I've got a whole set from the entire movie. Usually, like if you're a supervising animator and you design a character like I did with Raja, then you just get that character. But since I directed Brother Bear, I, I have a whole set of, I have a whole set of maquettes. So I'm assuming we're going to find some Brother Bear maquettes in here, some more because we're missing Tuke, we're missing Kenai Human. All right, let's see what we got here. Well, it says elk, 
So it could be anything. <laughs> Knowing our, our mover's sense of uh, animals. But this might be too. We've got rut over here from Brother Bear. And this might be Toque. Here, you reach in and pull it out. Yep, we got Toque here. Hey, how's it going, Bear? How's it going, Bear? All right, let's see here. Let's start pulling this apart. There he is. Look at that. That's toque or an elk. Well, I guess in, in Europe they call they call moose elk. Man, he did a good job with those. And what's interesting is you take this one. And you take this one, and they fit right together, just like that. Hey, how's it going, eh? Just like that. See that? So there we go. There's Rut and Toque. We've got, uh, let me bring Keen Eye over here. We've got Keen Eye. And Coda, Sitka, who's chasing them. There's Coda back there. All right, we got another box here. All right. Let's see what else we've got here. Let's see what we've got in here. I know who this is. Can you take that box? This one didn't even get taped. That was nice. It's Tanana. There she is. With a blue bird on her finger. Walking with her staff up the, up the mountain where the earth touches the sky. I always love her design. Put her right over here. Okay, this is our last box. Our last box of maquettes. It says man with sword. <laughs> I don't know what that means. <laughs> man with sword. Let's see here. Look at this, look what we got. It's like Christmas. It's like being reunited with old friends. That's what I love about it. All right, let's see what we got here. Let's see what's in here. It's a man with a sword. That's what the box says. A man with a sword. A man with a sword? I know Kenai has a spear. This is, it's Sitka. Here he is. There's old Sitka. Wisdom. He had the totem of wisdom. Of guidance, that's what I said. The eagle of guidance. <laughs> what does that mean? It was, uh, it was the Nahi that had the, uh, oh, this one says, this one says, man with a sward. Sward? It's a sward. <laughs> I guess they weren't very good at spelling either. But that's okay. They moved my stuff really well. And they packed it really well. Let's see what we got. This has got to be Kenai. Kenai is the only one left. 
All right, here's our last maquette. And it's Kenai. Good old Kenai. As a human. This is Kenai human. Because as you know, if you've seen Brother Bear, Kenai gets turned into a bear. And there's Kenai bear right there. There. See, there's a, a man with a sward. That's what this is. It's a man with a sward. <laughs> there he is. There's Kenai. Look at that. These, these sculptures, I just love them so much. And this is a full set. This is the entire cast of, of uh, Brother Bear. Pretty cool. So there we go. That was kind of fun. <laughs> these guys haven't seen the light of day in 10 years. Those boxes have been boxed up for 10 years. It's so nice to finally get these out and I'm going to get the dust off of them. But here's Raja from Aladdin and we've got the entire cast of Brother Bear. We've got Cusco from Emperor's New, New Groove. We've got Yao from Mulan up there. Simba from The Lion King. Tarzan from, what was that movie that he was in? Tarzan. <laughs> but here we are. This is my maquette collection. Once again, for those of you that didn't see the before, maquettes are used as drawing aids for the animators. Um, you know, when we're doing hand-drawn animation. These characters are, are sculpted like this, and then if we get into a difficult angle that's hard to imagine, then you take your maquette and you turn it and you look at it from different angles in it, and it's there as a drawing aid. So that's what we use them for. Plus, they make pretty darn good decorations, don't they? I just think they're beautiful pieces of art. I just, I just love them. And it uh, really brings back some great memories. I loved making that film. It was such a great time. I loved making Aladdin <laughs> and Mulan, Lion King. We had so much fun making those films. So there you go. There's my maquettes after 10 years. Thanks for uh, joining me in unboxing. Look at all the boxes we got to clean up now. Oh my gosh. Well, I got to go clean up boxes. Take it easy. Go put some beauty back into the world. Be nice to somebody and I'll talk to you next week. Thanks. Bye.